In this tutorial, I'll show you how to ban subtitles to video using CapCut for Windows. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Now, I've got my video here and I'll just drag it to the timeline right about there. There are two ways I can add captions to a video in CapCut, either using the auto captions or if you have the subtitles to that particular video. So if I go to text and click on auto captions, I can automatically transcribe the audio in this video into captions. So uh, I can use that. But for this, I'll go for local captions because I already have an SRT subtitle file for this. I'll click on import and then click on the subtitle I want and click on open. Just add it right about there and it's added. So captions, lyrics are di displayed in the default timestamp. If I actually zoom in slightly, I can now hover over one and you'll see a box somewhere here. It may not be clear, but if I click on this subtitle, you'll see it appear right about here. So one thing I may need to do is I may need to highlight all the subtitles like that and then change maybe, let's say the styling to be something like that. And we can now see the subtitles and then bump up the size slightly. Let's say we go with a size eight and then you can zoom in slightly right about here. So if I play this, uh, this is what we're going to have. With the recent update on the YouTube interface, it's now easier That's than what before. We get. And uh, one good thing with CapCut is that, for example, if you decide to have the line above uh, in just the normal casing and the line below in like a, a font that is a different styling, let's say bold. We bold that, you can even underline whatever you want, italicize, it's really up to you. You can actually select that, change the color to a different color. Uh, let's say we go with that. Uh, uh, let's say we go with a lighter version of that. Uh, looks good or even use a different style like this. So you can have different styles the way you want it to be. So let's assume you're done editing your subtitles, the different styles that you want, capitalizing words, etc. So what I'll do is I'll go to export and then from the export option, I'll make sure that the video exporting is selected. It's right there and also export audio. Everything is as I want it to be. So I'll just click on, let's say export and it's going to begin exporting. Let's give it a couple of seconds and once it's done our subtitles will be banned in to our video so it's almost done let's wait for it and see what the final video looks like so here we go we can open folder and then go to that folder double click on it let's play with the recent update on the you can now see how we have set our subtitles with the different options we've set up youtube interface it's now easier than before to download YouTube transcripts. Hi, my name. Everything looks like we want it to look like. So if I put it that way, that is how you can easily ban subtitles to a video using CapCut. That's it for this video. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning. Thanks for watching.